Hello everybody, Swift here again with another Brutator run. And today I'm gonna be doing a run with the Lich. This character is also very unique. So he gets HP regen, 10 lifesteal, already good stats, 100% chance to deal your health and damage to a random enemy when you heal. So we're gonna go full on healing build and then damage modifications are reduced by 50%. Uh, damage dealt zero from this passive. I think uh, the main choices are either you go with the pruner to get your spawning of these little hedges or SMG so that you have crazy attack speed and can heal with the lifesteal. We're gonna go obviously the SMG path. We're gonna continue on difficulty two until, um, you know, until whatever, I don't know. <laughs> until I'm sure about these characters being strong or not. I just want to get the wins, get the unlockables, and in general have fun and not exactly be like very uh, uptight with um, every single choice, you know, because in higher difficulties you need to min-max a bit more, while in lower difficulties it's just like more chill vibes, more experimental, more just having fun picking up random stuff. So uh, here I'm gonna say HP regen would be the choice. HP regen makes it so that you heal more often, if you see. So 1 HP every 0 0.85 seconds. Um, so that's really important. Of course, we're gonna go with a coupon and in our SMG. I see the metal gun, but honestly, I don't really want it. I don't want it. Let's roll. <laughs> Let's get our SMG. Very nice. And I found a pistol. Uh, I guess... Nah, I don't want this. Let's, uh, let's go. Healing is the way to go in general. Uh, but, um, yeah, and also max life. Healing and max life. Those two are very, very important. Because the passive does my max life and damage. And also healing is only good if you have enough max life to lose life first and then heal a bunch of times, right? So if I have, for example, 100 life or 200 life, then I can dip down to 50 um, and then heal back up and then do a bunch of damage to opponents, right? That's like the idea here. We need to get damage as much as we can. The amount of damage against dodge, really no. Range damage, luck, HP region. I'm gonna say let's get the luck. Uh, let's get the SMG. Harvesting and dodge, but lose a couple of damages. I mean, I'm gonna say yes to this. Early harvest always pays off for itself. We found max HP, which is really important. We're gonna take that to even more max HP per kills. Mm, I could go into this. I could go into this. But I'm not sure I want to... I'm not sure we're gonna even get 20 kills. Let's continue. I'm gonna try to get max health through other means. I don't need specifically those. Did I just decrease my damage? I think I just decreased my damage. Eh, it is what it is. Try to get hit as much as possible, by the way. How did I decrease my damage, by the way? Give me a second. It was the B. Yeah, it was the B. Dang it! I need to increase my my range damage again, because now we're doing two. Which is very bad. Although, wait a minute. My range damage is zero. Uh, do you see this? Like, my range damage is still zero. I guess it's zero, minus 0 0.5 is what it actually is. Of course, I want to get hit as often as possible, so that I can uh, attack more opponents all over the screen without actually needing to go there. So that's important. Harvesting give us money. Max HP, I would say. That's a good choice. Percent damage. Harvesting. Uh, harvesting early enough is good. This is like uh, almost 100 coins. That's good percent damage though. SMG and max life. And everything moves slower, me included. Opponents also. Uh, speed and engineering. Not really. Let's re-roll this for 4 because 4 is very low. And we're going to also buy this. And I think we don't need to roll for 5. So let's just continue. Now, as I said, my DPS is pretty low. But it doesn't matter because when I get hit, we start doing 22 damage to random opponents all over the place, right? So that's the idea. Uh, the SMGs are here only for actual lifesteal. They aren't here to actually DPS anything. The DPS comes from getting hit and then healing up. Get hit. Now you will see opponents slowly dwindle away. Slowly lose their life. <laughs> I mean, it's really important to get a lot of max life, to be honest. Because honestly, otherwise it won't be working. And also, it's very important to get percentage base damage so I can um, power up my passive uh, HP regen against lifesteal. I mean, I don't. Ah, no, no, no. We're gonna keep both max life or armor. I mean, I think max life is the play. Let's go with max life and enemies move slower. Let's roll these and in our SMG. Let's lock that down. They already cost 30. They used to cost 21. They, they co now they cost 30. HP regen against lifesteal. Once again, not really. Like, getting HP regen it increases how fast HP regen triggers, while having lifesteal makes it so that the SMG heals you more often. So, um, it's you lose one speed to gain another speed. And I'm not really sure if the life speed, lifesteal is faster or if the um, HP regen is faster. I'm pretty sure it's the lifesteal that's faster. Although, obviously, the difference is 2 to 1, but still, I think the lifesteal with each multi attack being extremely fast is very important. Of course, it's very important to get the tomato too, if I can find it. That's one of the more important items that this character really cares about. 8 lifesteal. Maybe even Etsy's Etsy's couch. Etsy's couch, whatever it's called. Yeah, maybe no move build fits with this guy too. 
movement speed, attack speed, pitch, you know, let's do all these. Melee damage, percent damage. Um, oop. <laughs> let's go percent damage. Now we're at six. Let's go. Four HP regen. That's good. Let's take that. The movement speed is in the negatives. Oh, that's also even more regen. We're going to take that. Uh, piggy bank is also here. We're going to buy all of these. We're going to reroll. Actually, I don't even want to roll. We're going to keep the money here for the for the piggy bank to get multiplied with. The damage is still at two. Okay, we definitely, definitely need to increase the... Um, we need to increase our range damage. I need to get like a couple of range damage dots. Because the difference between doing two damage per shot and three damage per shot is pretty sizable, obviously. Let's get hit on purpose. I just got hit for six. Okay, gotta, I gotta point out that ranged attacks in general do um, do more damage, uh, less damage. Ranged attacks uh, tend to do half the damage as normal attacks. Oh no, I just got hit for four, so that theory doesn't really bode well. Well, it is what it is. I'm full life anyway, so we continue getting hit on purpose, so we get more kills, so we get more damage. Oh no, opponents are incoming. Oh no, whatever. We are still getting so much damage out of this. I mean, even if opponents hit us, like, because we heal so much, we uh, hit them back. Max HP, I think, is the play. Harvesting against me. Yeah, this is going to pay for itself extremely fast. So I'm going to buy this right now. And I'm also going to buy the XP gain. That's very important. And I'm not going to roll once again. Piggy Bank continue giving us money. Those 9 coins are pretty much 11 points through the Piggy Bank. Or, or 10 coins, based on if it rounds up or rounds down. Which, I mean, I guess it, is, it doesn't even round. Maybe it gives you 0.5. And then decides to give you the round up or round down based on whatever. Uh, let's continue attacking. And maybe the round down doesn't even matter because even if I don't waste 7 coins, well, if I have 8, then it will round out up by definition. It will be uh, exactly a round number. Anyway, let's continue attacking everything we find and let's not forget to get hit on purpose. Because look how fast we heal. And the thing is, like, the trick is the following. It's not only about the fact that we heal, right? Because you might think, yeah, but if you lose too much life and you aren't fast at healing, then you might die before you actually have the time to heal. Yeah, but every time I heal, an opponent also dies. So uh, it's not only that we heal more, but we also DPS the opponents more. Let's go with 12% damage. Okay, here we found 3 range. We're going to take it. Take it. I saw the 3. Ah, this is really good for us. We're going to buy that for sure. And uh, we're not going to buy anything. Actually, dodge and harvesting. Once again, it's going to pay for itself in time. Now I'm okay with my range damage. Hitting enemy removes their speed. Not really. Armor and engineering, but lose max life. Not really. Uh, get a bunch of stats, but lose um, regen. Uh... Also not really. I want one more SMG, by the way. I'm searching for the SMG. Speed and lifesteal, but lose a lot. I mean, this is good for us. Lifesteal is important, and speed is something I want. Damage, but lose attacks, but I'm okay with this too. And uh, lack against damage, I'm okay with this too. And I'm okay with this too. I want to buy all of these, so we're gonna lock them down, and we're gonna get the money out of it. So, uh, let's go. Hit us, please hit us. Boom, here we go. We got it for 8. So that means we have 8 room to heal. Look at this. We have 43 life already. Like, we are very tanky already. And once again, even if opponents do 20 damage to us, the only thing I need to do for, to counteract 20 damage and be actually powerful is have a lot of max life and a lot of healing. As long as I maintain a healthy healing speed and a lot of max life, it doesn't matter if an opponent does 20 or 30 damage to us, because 20 damage... What do you think 20 damage means in reality? 20 damage means that I have 20 pips of life to damage the opponents with, right? Because life steal heals you one at a time, and HP region also heals you one at a time, as far as I know. It's like 1 1 1 1 1. So, um, yeah, that's 1 1 1 1 1. That means opponents get hit for, you know, 44, 44, 44, 44. So, really, really, really enjoyable. I really enjoy the class already. What an insane class. And, and just being, you know, so chilly and just running through opponents is cool too. Like in harvesting, that's a definite yes. Uh, I got 15% attack speed and 12% damage. Uh, I think I'm gonna go with the attack speed. To maintain my uh, good DPS. And we're going to buy all of these. So let's buy, 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 buy. And we roll for zero. And find an SMG. I will buy this now. And then let's go. I don't really want this. It says healing with material. But I don't want to lose my range damage. We need to have some kind of range damage in general. Like we, we need to be able to deal with something. It's not all about the damage all the time. Now I just realized something else too by the way. This character is also really good with those uh, plus one health as many opponents you kill. I mean, I obviously should have realized it a bit earlier when we had the access to that. But um, now that I actually, you know, think about it, this character is really good with a couple of builds. Uh, max HP build for one is what you want to go with this guy. Uh, but still, doesn't really matter. And once again, as I said, as you see, as you saw previously, look at this. I I'm in danger zone, I'm about to die, and then because I have too little life, I have so much room to heal that everything on the screen just gets hit for 50 damage now. I mean, it isn't even 50, by the way. It is 56. 
Because that's why I'm scaling percent damage, by the way, so that my health gets multiplied by a higher amount. Now, from here on out, I should scale health. Like, whenever health, HP, region, and lifesteal, those are the three things I would like to get every time we go into a shop. Uh, not shop, a level. Every time we gain a level, those three things is what we would actually like to get. With the best one being a max life. Damage against range, that's a yes. Melee damage, percent damage. You know what? Let's reroll these maybe. Four level. Let's get six max life. That's exactly what I wanted. 15 luck is good. I think it's the time to get armor though. Or movement. Nah. I think luck. Thought luck. Let's get luck. My luck is at 22, which is pretty sizable. Let's get an SMG. Let's combine these and buy another one. Very nice. Uh, I don't want to heal more from healing. I want to heal as little as possible. Repost when I dodge. Max life and more damage and more enemies. That's definite yes. When I dodge, I deal melee damage. One damage to the opponents. Awesome. Very powerful. Very useful. Lose max life but gain armor and dodge. I mean, no. We, we don't care about defense. We care about healing and HP regen. Lifesteal against knockback. That's a definite yes. Uh, damage against range, that's also a yes, because once again, damage gets actually, uh, actually does affect my passive, so now we're doing 72, although I have 60 life. Another roll for 25 here, and, uh, I think this is the last thing I'm gonna buy, and I want to buy this one too. You know what, there is no reason to buy them, actually. I mean, I will buy the luck, but this one I'm not gonna buy. Uh, and once again, I'm okay with having less range, as, uh, I am back practically melee build. I want to be running in and getting hit by opponents, and then hitting them back for as much as possible. Of course, range is important uh, in the case I, I'm not close enough to opponents to be able to lifesteal from them, right? Because you can only lifesteal when you actually hit something, but still. I mean, look at this, look at this. We, <laughs> we, uh, when we get hit, we heal so fast that literally the whole screen dies. And then I, I don't even have opponents to hit to heal off. I'm only tanks, only tanks. Tanky units are the only units that actually survive, so maybe I should stick to tanks. Well, in that vein, elites are gonna be really good with this guy, so I'm excited to see that. Look at this, just, just the screen disappears and we heal extremely fast. I love it, I love it. And I want to have even more max health, so I'm never afraid about actually using. But, um, yeah, for now, we're just running around in circles. It seems like it's a permanent panic, panic, panic mode, but I don't feel like that. I really don't. Let's get hit, and let's continue moving in circles around everything. Very nice. And the more we get hit, of course, the more problem we come. I don't need this money. Uh, I could take this, but uh, I'm gonna say money. 12% damage, 3 max life. Let's get the percent damage once again. 15 luck. You know what? 4 HP region is what I would say. Or 15 luck. <laughs> I'm not good at doing what I'm supposed to do. Okay, we're gonna get lifesteal here. Let's roll. Lifesteal even more. Luck against and lifesteal and movement speed. You know what? 133 is a lot for piggy bank. So we're gonna just lock that down and not even roll. This is gonna give us a lot of money. And we have 422. So close to the god number. I mean, it's not a god number. The meme number would be more fitting. Uh, this is supposed to be uh, a big wave, which uh, means that we're not gonna fight an elite, which is very disappointing to say the least, but it is what it is. Continue healing, continue attacking upon. Man, I love this character so much. The fact that, oh no, we're dying, and then I'm healing so fast that opponents are actually dying faster. I love it. I straight up love it. Although I start feeling like there are too many opponents on the screen for the passive to even happen. Yeah, you see, the passive is killing things, but it's killing them all over the screen. So, uh, it's not actually killing things that I need to. I see in the background things are getting hit. I'm actually not only background, everywhere. I'm seeing opponents getting hit everywhere. But, uh, we need, we need more. We need more health. We need like three or four hundred health, to be honest. Because this here is on the lower end of things. And uh, the more life we have, obviously, the more powerful we're gonna become. So, nice, 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 nice. That's what we get. Burning spreads, not really. What's on even more healing? Yes. Range and damage. Uh, I do enjoy range. Let's get 45 range to be f to be done with that. Let's take this. Take this. Less armor, more crit chance. I mean, this is pretty useless for us. Um, even more range? I mean, might as well. We're on SMG build, so... so uh, engineer, nope. Uh, chance to heal, nope. Lose one life. Mm, you know what? I can take five of these or just hope I'm gonna get one of my passive. No, 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 no. Why why, why is there a passive that is almost like my passive? I found a minigun. Very nice. We're gonna obviously buy that. And max life against dodge. We're gonna buy both of these. And they are very expensive. I mean, I would also like to buy this. Dodge and crit chance. Dodge is good. Dodge is good. The reason why dodge is good is because it... Uh, is dodge good? I think for this character, dodge is better. Normally, I'm saying that armor is safety. But for this character, I think dodge is better. Because you want to get hit once and then dodge the rest. Until you heal back up. Instead of being like... Getting hit every half a second. You want to be hit like... Once every five attacks, something like that. Once every five attacks for 20 is better than uh, all five attacks 
four, four. Like you might say five times four is twenty, and twenty times one is also twenty. But um, I don't know, man. I don't know. I I don't have a good. Uh, <laughs> this is a classic. But Sif, and then Sif doesn't have anything to explain. <laughs> but Sif, the two things you said are literally the same. The thing you're saying doesn't even make sense. I guess the sense is that I prefer getting hit once for a big hit so that I can heal it back up and then just hope for RNG to save us than being like, I cannot get away from getting hit every second. Something like that. Uh, harvesting in Star Wars might as well. Uh, six dodge. Uh, I'm gonna roll here for me both. If you like, I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna buy all three of these. So let's uh, let's combine these. Let's go buy, 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 buy. Attack speed against damage. I'm gonna say yes to this. Another SMG, very nice. Another lifesteal, another damage. Let's roll again. Uh, I don't need to roll more. 3D, we have 47. Man, the, the piggy bank is giving us so much money because, of course, we're using and abusing it, but whatever. I have even negative armor now, and now we actually do damage. As you see, we are getting kills without even needing to use our passive. Now, if we even use our passive, it's even better. Of course. Hey, look at this. We mainly heal through lifesteal. HP regen is not really doing that much for us. I would like to get the tomato, though. I would really like to get the tomato. Because, um, yeah, I mean, we, we are healing a lot through lifesteal, though. Like, lifesteal is definitely healing us a lot. The, to the HP region, not really, but lifesteal does its job exactly how it's supposed to. And that's why I want to get the tomato. I think eight HP region does make a decent difference. And uh, I don't even know what my HP region is right now. But having like 50 or 60 HP region would be good. Now, the best item, if I could choose one legendary item to get, it would obviously be Grind's Leaf. Because um, that thing is obviously <laughs> giving you every round one or three more health, one more healing, and one more lifesteal. So this character is really, really, really a Grand Sleeve character. Hopefully we're gonna find one. Chance to deal damage to opponents, I mean, yeah, why not? Uh, yeah, also alien eyes, obviously, yes. Three range damage, I mean, we are range damage built, so obviously, yes. Let's combine this by another SMG. HP recovery items, not really. Dodge if I don't move, not really. And roll these. Explosion damage, yes! <laughs> the first damage taken, no. Uh, fun on SMG, very nice. Fun obliterator. I mean, we don't want that. We want to heal as much as we can. And also the medical turret, because why not? Fun on SMG, very nice. Let's continue combining and keep buying. Uh, let's reroll one last time. Chance to deal damage when an enemy dies. I mean, let's buy this and let's go. Let's go. Uh, and now we have a healing to it. Being part of the build, which is also really useful. Do these guys shoot? I think these guys shoot, so we want them be alive. Where, where, where did that guy shoot? Did you see a bullet fly off to the top left? Go back in the footage for three seconds and go look at that. He just shot to the top left. Two nowhere is that. <laughs> okay, we got hit for 15 for twice. Twice for 15. Okay. So we definitely are taking a lot of damage. We gotta keep that in mind. That, uh, yeah, we, we are very weak on defense. I think I need to get, like, one armor drop. One purple armor level would be good. Like, if I could have five armor, I think that would be the golden uh, number. Normally I'm saying 20 armor, but with this guy, because I do want to get hit for a lot every time I get hit, I, I want to get hit for about 10 damage per second, because that's how much we still heal from life steal. I mean, I mean, and if we then also include the food we find, and we also include the HP region we have, I guess 15 per second would be good. But for you to get hit for 15 per second, opponents need to not do 15 damage to you. Um, let's get attack speed. I still don't want this. Uh, let's reroll here. Are you serious? Are you serious? 8% damage? Not really. Too ranged, I guess. Laser gun legendary. Nope. Max life. And now minigun. Okay, we're obviously gonna get our minigun. Combine and buy. And let's roll. Who's melee damage for harvesting? Is this gonna pay itself in time? No, it's not. Uh, damage against range? Uh, not really. One last reroll. Uh, I'm gonna buy the lifesteal and I'm gonna also buy this next round, obviously. Although that's gonna cost us a reroll. Eh, the rerolls are pretty cheap ish. So we're gonna make these into money. And I think we're good to go. The trees can survive how much they want. I don't care. If anything, I want to heal more of them. Wait, are the SMGs doing 10 and the miniguns doing 3 and 1? Wait, are the miniguns doing 1 damage? 3 damage. 10, 10, 10, 10, 3. Okay, so what is doing 1 damage? I'm seeing some 1 damage shots. Well, the good thing is my passive is doing 108 damage. So there's that, I guess. But I don't know what is doing 1 damage. I'm seeing some 1s. You see all these little 1s? Wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. Do the minigun pierce? Yeah, the minigun pierce. Okay, so the minigun piercing is what does the one damage. It does three normally, and then when the pierce hits, it does one. So good to know. And we're taking even more damage now. Like, we used to be taking 15, now we take 16. Ooh, and what does the melee damage do? I would like to get hit by a melee opponent, please. Run into them. Whoa. Okay, I think I got hit for 10. 
damage isn't really that much. To be honest. It's on the lower end of things. 10 isn't that much. And I get a legendary item for my drops. I mean, I have like a pure 60 luck. So we're gonna get Ryan's Leap or maybe my own items if it's a relic. Would be nice. Pick everything up. Uh, pick up range, that's an obvious yes. Yes, so we found armor I wanted. Literally, didn't I say three armor? Three armor was been found. Nope, that's money, nope, that's money. Rip and tear. Lose harvesting, but gain damage. I mean, yeah, why not? Let's have some explosion. Harvesting is at this point very useless. I mean, not very useless. Three range damage. Uh, you know what? We're gonna go for nine he health here. Nine health, nine health. This is a forced, uh, forced purple, so nine health here we go. Thank you very much. Now my armor is at 12% less damage taken, which is exactly how much I wanted it to be. Range damage and attack speed against damage. I'm gonna say yes, although damage is obviously affecting my passive, but still. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go more damage. Zero for reroll. Attack speed based on how many opponents are on the screen, and then two armor. We lose armor. Now we're gonna go for your lifesteal, reroll for 29. Lose the three armor we just gained for 25% damage, which isn't even 25% damage, it's actually 12.5 damage. Not really that good. Crit chance 2%. Let's go, money! <laughs> uh, I think... I, I think we can just buy this for the piercing to be just a smidge better. Nah, I don't think that's useful. That's not even a roll. That's not by anything. Let's go. Let's just go. I mean, the difference there would be instead of doing um, 4 damage on the front enemy and then 2 damage on the back enemy because it's a 50% damage reduction per pierce, it would become something like... E either it would become 3... Or it would still stay at 2, so... Eh, who cares? Right, like, really, who, who cares about the half the damage that we would gain from piercing, uh, using piercing on the minigun? Like, it's it's borderline irrelevant. And I'm definitely not gonna get the piercing passive, I think. I mean, I'm not sure. I, I mean, definitely because I'm not gonna find it, not because I wouldn't choose it. If knows his future. Whoa! I believe in my luck, therefore I can also believe in my non-luck at the same time. You see, I don't believe in my luck, I believe I'm super lucky. But uh, sometimes, you know, you, you have to concede what you won't find, so that when you ask for something and you find it, you're like, haha, told you so. <laughs> now I'm gonna be like, haha, told you so, we didn't find the piercing. Uh, let's continue shooting opponents. Da -da 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 -da. 900 coins, we're super rich. The Waterbot, let's go join, the collab with Waterbots, here we go. <laughs> 10 luck. Sniper rifle, obviously no. Garden that heals, yes, we want a little healing garden. Movement speed gives us damage, I mean, this is straight up damage right now, so let's take it. Tomato! Let's buy it! Uh, this and this, and let's not roll anymore. Now I start with half-life, but I have even more healing. How much, every, when do I heal? Every 0.43. So every 0 0.33, 43, somebody gets hit for 94 damage. Actually more than 94, because as we said, we actually heal more than what it says. And I really enjoy that when there is one opponent left. First of all, I really enjoy the fact that it's it, it destroys everything. But if there is one opponent left, for example, when we're going to go into the boss room and I'm going to stick on top of the boss, everything on the screen is going to die. And then every other healing is going to hit the boss. But the main thing I enjoy is that this thing uh, is good against tanks, right? Because tanks like these guys, the mummies, uh, they can take a beating, therefore they give me so much healing that everything on the screen clears, right? Like, I'm like, Trrr. they're trying to survive because they're super tanky, and I'm like, okay, because you're surviving, I'm healing extremely fast, and everything on the screen dies until only you are left, and then all the healing shots go onto him, and then they go down too. So that's really enjoyable how that interaction is happening. What an awesome character, man. Lich, maybe contender for the most unique, not maybe most unique, but most awesome character. And we found Retro Hoodie. Which uh, gives us 10% attack speed, and we lose all our range pretty much. Mm, no, no, we're gonna make that into money. Let's get luck against the HP regen. <laughs> Atromation, we just threw your item away. Although I love it, it's one of the better items in this game, but I'm not a dodge build, so. Uh, throw luck away for max life and HP regen, that's the most definite yes I've ever seen. For every different weapon, we get, well, uh, attack speed. Otherwise, we only gain damage. Lose dodge and harvesting. Mm, not really... I mean, 12% attack speed and 12% damage, 6% damage, 6% damage, 12% attack speed, lose a dodge and harvesting. I mean, I borderline don't even have dodge, so let's buy this 300 for it, by the way. And uh, I think we're good here. Let's go. We lost some dodge. Doesn't really matter. We have 520, the new meme number. 520, let's go. <laughs> I guess Aqua it. Get it? Because not Blaze, but Aqua. Yeah, stupid memes. I'm not good at them, man. I'm not good at creating two memes other than just by happening. Let's go on. Let's continue. Let's destroy everything. What does by happening mean? Well, by happening means it just happened, you know, when I'm just like... Oh, I, I forgot something very important. I forgot the explosion to be visible. Oh, the explosions are visible. Did that change how the explosions look? 
I remember they looked like white lights. Now they look like smoke. So that's nice to see. Also, it feels like 20% chance to explode is not really what's actually happening because I'm not seeing 20% of the opponents that I explode. Although once again, the explosion became so smaller that it's not really that visible anymore anyway. Try to get hit on purpose, but I'm avoiding the hits by mistake. Ah, here we go. At 16 damage, let's go. Once again, 16 damage in reality means uh, 16 enemies will get hit for 110 damage. Multiplied with how much damage I also have. Speed for luck, not really. Uh, 6 marks life, yep. Uh, life still against life still no. No to that. What's my damage of my passive? 178. Very nice. Coupon, let's go. That's gonna save us a lot of money. Uh, let's lose damage but gain health and max regen. That's really, really good. Because we lose damage and gain damage. We're gonna combine these and combine these. We're gonna buy this and this. Might be a bad idea. I don't care. Blood donation. Yes. Yes. I take one damage per second. But I uh, have, you know, I also... That means that I deal... 187 damage per second to something. I have found this thing so many times. Pick up range and SMG. Yes. Um, you know, we're going to lock this down for the next wave. And let's go. And I will be taking a hit per second. That's really, really, really good. I, I can't even explain how good it is. Now, now that I got this, though, now that I got the blood bank, I need to make 100% sure I'm never, ever, ever picking up the triangle of power. Uh, because that's gonna literally kill the run, but whatever. I have so much healing, I have so much lifesteal. I mean, right now, my HP region alone is uh, 2.6 per second, so that alone is enough for us to never lose life from the blood bank. Actually, what the blood bank is doing is it's counteracting the lifesteal. The HP region, not the lifesteal, the HP region. So that, that's literally what blood bank does. It makes HP region irrelevant. Now, of course, I have so much lifesteal and so much attack speed that HP region is in general irrelevant. We're healing through attacking anyway. But now that we got this, I think the time has come to invest into armor. He says at wave 19, literally before winning. <laughs> With a straight face. Anyway, look at everything getting hit. Look at everything getting hit. We're healing, healing, healing. Healing, healing, healing. Random Yoshi music. Uh, let's go with damage, range. Yep, that's a yes. Uh, luck. Yeah, let's go. No, we're gonna go range damage. Uh, let's pick up the SMG. You know what? At this point, throw out the, the trash we picked up. And now we're going to spend all our money because there is no reason to try to keep it further. So, uh, speed range, no. Another water bots, I don't think we nod that. We nod that. We nod that. We don't nod that. Let's take this. And I would even say let's get wisdom. And uh, at this point, and our blood bank would really, really like to buy this. And would also like to buy this, but we can't. So let's go and win. Hopefully, that is. Where's the boss? Here it is. Da -da 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 -da. Look how fast we're healing. Look how fast we're healing. Half of these attacks will hit the boss. Stick on the boss to heal even more. Look at... Whoa, we are so powerful, man. Look at this. Look at the boss melting hundreds of damages. And we won. And we won. Win, run with the Lich. Let's see what we unlocked. Something that gives max life. Looks awesome. I like tentacles. Limited 10. 10% 10 chance to heal one when killing an enemy with a crit. And if you get it 10 times, you always heal when you kill an enemy with a crit. So this is very bad. This is extremely bad. <laughs> Why is this bad, you might ask? Well, ask. Uh, the following question is the answer to this. First of all, if this thing at the level 10, like if you get this 10 times, if this has a 100% chance to heal you for 10 on crit, then it's good. Okay, then it's good. If this is 100% chance to heal for 10 when it triggers, then it's actually good at max level. But if not, then if at max level this is a 100% chance to heal for 1 when killing an enemy with a crit, then I'm going to ask you the following. Is it better to get 1 health, okay, 1 health when you get a kill with a crit? Or is it easier to get one health with 44% chance on hit? Not on crit, on hit. So, obviously this is better because you can hit an opponent 5, 6, 7, 10 times and you can heal so many more times than just getting one crit that also has to kill. Like, it's a kill and also a hit crit. Like, it's, it's very, very rare to happen. I would say if you remove the crit part, then maybe, then maybe I would say that this is do this is, this is decent. Uh, and it's only 10%, right? I'm seeing this getting buffed, by the way. I'm seeing this a mile away getting buffed. It's either not going to have the crit chance part, or it's going to be or and, or and, not only or, but or and. It might have both of these buffs. 20% chance to heal one when killing an enemy, and then limit it to five. That would be maybe better, uh, in my opinion. Uh, but I, I don't know. Maybe first remove the crit part. Maybe first remove the crit part and be like 10% chance to heal one. And I'm going to repeat here. If it is that every time you get it, like if you get it 10 times, it's 100% chance to heal for 10. If that is how it works, 
then it might be decent, okay? I, I, I want to kill heal 10, then, then it actually is good, actually, because then you can go into a crit build with tentacles, and then every single kill you get is 10 healing, so that would keep you very much alive. But if it's only one health, no matter how many you have, then it, it, it isn't really good. Like, uh, one health per crit, uh, per kill, isn't really uh, that crazy. Lifesteal does a better effect on that. Now, of course, this doesn't have a cap, so I guess whatever. Uh, as you see, classic sift overanalyzing something that maybe nobody cares about, but if you did care about it, comment down below and tell me about it, uh, that you care about my feedback and whatnot, and you could also comment about anything you would like, really. Uh, I'm reading the comments, and also don't forget to drop a like to the channel, subscribe if you want to see more, because we're playing a bunch of games again and again, and uh, as always, thanks for the Patreon and membership supporters, and now that I mentioned membership supporters, don't forget to spam those emojis, make the other people jealous that they don't have them, or you can also become a member for only one buck, you're gonna have the blind emoji uh, for me whenever I miss something, right? When I re-roll the shop away while uh, there was something that you wanted me to pick up, that's why blind emoji is there. Anyway, that's going to be it for today, I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, uh, I'm glad, I'm happy. So as always, <laughs> thanks for watching, and see you guys around.